Merlin, with its magical world and legendary story, enchanted many viewers. It must have been a fantastic experience for people to discover this series through CNBC. Merlin captivated audiences with its portrayal of magic, adventure, and friendship while recounting the legendary tale of King Arthur. If you haven't watched the series, you should definitely give it a chance. Matt Smith, known for his role as the Doctor in Doctor Who and many other projects, was nearly cast as Merlin, but the role was ultimately taken by Colin Morgan. In the series, Katie, who portrays the character Morgana, used her natural Irish accent, while Irish actor Colin Morgan mimicked an English accent. Katie almost didn't get the role because the producers didn't want two actors speaking with an Irish accent in the series. And if he couldn't speak like an Englishman, in other words, if Colin couldn't nail the English accent, they were ready to reject him for the role. During times when Colin Morgan wasn't filming to avoid looking pale in one scene and bronzed in another, he often had to stay indoors or in the shade. We know that one of the Knights of the Round Table had the Galician original name Arta Pendragon. Pendragon, or sometimes written as Pendrake, means Red Dragon, and it's the national symbol of Wales, which holds significant importance in Welsh mythology and is frequently featured in the Arthurian legend. We know that Merlin's real name in Welsh is Merdin W-Y-L-L-T. Merdin is the given name, and W-Y-L-L-T could be a family name or a surname for the Celtic figure who lived in the 6th century known as Vduit. The name Dewitt is likely to be translated into English as Ambrosius, because it's a version that emerges when translated from Galician to English. The language used in spells is Old English. The writers have written the spells in English and sometimes have had them translated by a language consultant, occasionally translating them into Old English. The ancient jewelry, talismans, and symbols seen in the series are based on artifacts exhibited in the Viking Center in York, UK. The castle depicted in the series is Pierre Castle, located about 100 kilometers northeast of Paris. In the 18th century, like many other castles, it was partially demolished. In the first season, the sword forged using the dragon's breath of Kilgara needed to be Excalibur. The sword was used several times throughout the series, but was never referred to as Excalibur, it was only referred to as the sword forged with the dragon's breath. Nathaniel Parker, who portrayed the character Agravain, joined the cast due to his children being fans of the show. While on set during breaks in filming, Bradley James and Colin Morgan showcased their hidden musical talents by creating songs. These songs were not meant to be disclosed to the public, but their fans uploaded them to YouTube. Emilia Fox, who portrayed the character Morgors, was pregnant during the filming of the third season. Rupert Young, who portrayed the character Sir Leon, was originally supposed to appear in just one episode. However, he gained such popularity among fans that the writers decided to feature him as a recurring character. As a result, he became a regular cast member in the fourth season. The dragon voiced by Sir John Hart, the goblin voiced by Mark Williams, and Sid Elder voiced by Michael Jennings are individuals who are not physically seen in the series. The transformation of Colin Morgan into King Emery's with prosthetics took approximately four hours. According to IMDb, the highest rated episode of the series has a rating of 9.1, belonging to season 3, episode 13. The lowest rated episode, on the other hand, has a rating of 7.2, and it is from season 4, episode 8.